Hello friends. In previous video, we have discussed the difference between the source coding and channel coding, and why we need the uh, source coding and channel coding. Now today we will discuss about the source coding techniques. Now we know that uh, source coding is used to reduce redundancy and it also reduces the bandwidth now if we reduce the bandwidth it means that it will ultimately do the compression so we can say that source coding we do for achieving the compression while sending the data on communication channel source coding in source coding we have to discuss about the two terms that is fixed length coding and second one is variable length coding now consider a discrete memoryless source information source discrete memoryless information source means a uh, information source which is discrete and memoryless what do you mean by memoryless source <coughs> it is the information source which doesn't have the memory means a particular symbol probability of occurrence of a particular symbol does not dependent on the previous symbol okay because it doesn't have the memory and it is generating the symbols in discrete manner that's why it is called as a discrete memoryless source now consider this discrete memoryless source which is emitting the symbols this uh, source is emitting the symbols with some probability now consider that these are the symbols a b c d e f g and h these are the symbols emitted by the discrete emitted by discrete memoryless source information source now when we do the source coding means we map these symbols with the with some bits like 001 000, 000 and 111 <clears throat> what we are doing we are mapping this symbol which is emitted by the discrete memoryless uh, this discrete memoryless source whatever symbols are emitted which we transmit on the communication channel these symbols we are mapping with the binary bits okay so the length length of this binary that is the length of this code this we can call the code source code the length of this code is 3 bit so all of these codes have got the length 3 bits and that is fixed that is fixed that's why this type of coding is called as fixed length coding but in fixed length coding we cannot achieve the compression it is uncompressed it is not the compressed data we, we cannot achieve the compression in fixed length coding now in variable length coding now we will discuss the variable length coding the symbols are assigned with the codes of variable length that is nothing but the variable length coding so if the codes are very length of the codes are variable then we can achieve the compression we can achieve the compression and that too with zero error now how it can be done that we will see consider the discrete memoryless source consider this discrete memoryless source emitting some symbols these symbols a b c d h consider that these eight symbols are emitted by this uh, discrete memoryless information source so what we can do in variable length coding we can map these symbols with the codes of variable length suppose a is assigned or mapped with code 
these are the coat are mapped with zero b is mapped with 1 0 c is mapped with suppose 0 1 1 0 E is mapped with suppose one zero one 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 zero. G is mapped with double one double zero, and H is mapped with suppose one one zero one. So, in this case, what we can observe that this A is mapped with only one bit code. B and C are mapped with two bits code, and these three are mapped with three bit code. and these g and h these two symbols are mapped with four bit code so this is nothing but the variable length coding in which we can achieve the compression and that too with the zero error we come across two terms that is non singular code and prefix code now first we will discuss the non singular code we will try to define the non singular code the code is non singular if each code word is mapped with entirely different non empty bit string example we will take example to understand the non singular code now consider this example one in which suppose a is assigned to 1 b is assigned to 0 1 1 C is assigned to zero, triple one zero. In this mapping, what we can observe that each code, each symbol, is assigned with a unique code. That's why it is a non-singular code. Non-singular code. If we take now second example, where A is assigned zero, B is assigned zero, and C is <coughs> assigned one. Now, in this case, what we observe that A and B are both assigned with zero, so it is not a non-singular code. To understand the prefix code, we will consider two examples. First, we will consider a symbol A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, where. the symbols are assigned with code 00010 c is mapped with 011 d is mapped with 100 and h with 1111 okay so these are the variable length code now if we using this code if we want to send one message that is a bad cab if we want to send this message a bad cab okay so if we send this message a bad cab from this information source then with this variable length code a for a we will send 00 for b we will send 010 for a again 00 For D, it is one zero zero. Then for C, it is zero one one. For A, it is again zero zero. And for B, it is zero one zero. This is from the transmitter side. We have transmitted the message. Now, at the receiver side, at the receiver side, when the message is received as zero zero. Zero one zero 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 one double zero zero double one double zero zero one zero. When the message is received, initially the receiver will first check for zero zero. It will come to know that it is the code word of A. It will interpret it as A. Then it will check for zero one. But the receiver know that zero one is not the code word given to any um, other symbol. so it will check for 3 bit 010 which is the code word of b then it will check for 00 which is the code word for a then it will check for 10 and receiver know that 10 is not the code word then it will check for 100 which is the code word given for d then it will check for 
जीरो वन इज ऑल्सो नॉट द कोड वर्ड इट विल चेक फॉर जीरो वन वन विच इज द कोड वर्ड फॉर सी देन इट विल चेक फॉर ट्रिपल जीरो सॉरी डबल जीरो डबल जीरो इज द कोड वर्ड ऑफ ए देन इट विल चेक फॉर जीरो वन जीरो वन इज नॉट अ कोड वर्ड देन इट विल चेक फॉर जीरो वन जीरो विच इज द कोड वर्ड फॉर बी सो इट विल इंटरप्रिट द मैसेज एज अ बैड कैब at the receiver side this is how by using the variable length code uh, it will interpret the message now we will consider one another example of prefix code where a is assigned with 0 b is assigned 1 c 0 0 d 0 1 e 1 0 f 1 1 g 0 0 and h 0 1 1 okay we will call this as variable length code 2 and earlier as variable length code 1 now for the same message sequence a bad cap a bad cap we will consider the uh data now for a we will send 0 for b we will send 1 for a again 0 for d the code word is 0 1 for d code word is code word is 0 1 for c it is 0 0 for a it is 0 and for b it is 1 okay so this sequence will be transmitted for this message of bad cap okay now at the transmitter side this message is transmitted now at the receiver side at receiver side when we receive this message then it will be received as 0 1 0 1 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 